using 2XL enhancement. Enlighting a portion of a photo. The image enhancement tool allows you to enhance a particular portion of the photo. Consider the following template page. Now select the photo which requires enhancement. Click the PXL enhancement button on the main screen to open up the PXL enhancement window. By default, the window will open in the image enhancement mode and the pen tool selected. The selected photo is also displayed in the PXL enhancement window ready for editing. For highlighting a selected portion of the photo and converting background into black and white, you need to mark the area to be highlighted. For this, with the help of the mouse, left click on the point where you wish to start the selection from. Notice that the first point of selection is displayed with a small circle in magenta. Now, move the pen and take it to the next point along the contours of the area to be highlighted and click again. Notice that the selection path appears as a green line. For making the edges smooth, you can drag the mouse keeping the mouse key pressed and releasing the mouse button when the desired curvature is reached. Likewise, go on marking the area of selection till you cover the entire area. You can undo a selection by the right click of the mouse. Click on the first node or press the enter button on the keyboard to complete the selection. Notice that the area outside the selection is converted to black and white with the area within the selection remaining in color. The selection path becomes dashed and the pen tool gets deselected. The image editing options panel appears at the bottom. Notice that the selection path turns dotted and the pen tool gets converted into a cursor. Making multiple selection areas. The image enhancement tool also allows you to enhance multiple areas in a photograph. Make sure that you have already completed a selection of a portion of the photo. Click on the Pen Tool button to activate the Pen Tool for selecting the enhancement area. With the help of the mouse, left click on the point where you wish to start the selection from. This first point gets marked as a small circle in magenta. Now move the pen and take it to the next point along the contours of the area to be highlighted. Notice that the selection path appears as a green line. Likewise, go on marking the area of selection till you cover the entire area. Click on the first node or press the enter button on the keyboard to complete the selection. The selection area will always appear in its original color. Making selection within a selection area. DG Photo Art Gold allows you to create multiple selection paths on the same photo. Each selection area is treated as a separate layer and you can manipulate these layers independently. Make sure that you have already completed a selection of a portion of the photo. Click on the Pen Tool button to activate the Pen Tool for selecting the enhancement area. With the help of the mouse, left click on the point where you wish to start the selection from. This point is marked with a small circle in magenta. Now, move the pen and take it to the next point along the contours of the area to be highlighted and click again. Notice that the selection path appears as a green line. You can also zoom in or zoom out by pressing the plus or minus button on the keyboard for making the selection path accurate. For having a better control on the photo in the work area, you can press the space bar to activate the hand tool. Keeping the spacebar and the left key pressed, move the mouse to set the photo in the work area. Likewise, go on marking the area of selection till you cover the entire area. Click on the first node or press the enter button on the keyboard to complete the selection. The selection area will always appear in its original color. Click the gray scale button to convert the selection area into black and white so as to match with the background. Editing the selection path. You can also make changes to the selection path at any point of time after completing the selection. Click on the selection tool to select a selection area. Click the selection area which requires editing. 
the selected area appears as dashed. Click on the Convert Selection button. The selected area appears as the background color and the selection nodes are displayed with a green path. Now, right click on any of the nodes to activate a menu for adding and deleting nodes. Selecting the Add node will add a new node between two nodes. Similarly, Delete node will delete a selected node. You can edit the selection path by holding the Shift or Control key and dragging the node with the help of the mouse. Shift key moves the nodes while Control key smoothens the curves, keeping the nodes fixed. After all the modification of the selected area have been made, click the Convert Selection button. The changes to the selection get immediately applied and the selection area gets displayed in its original color. Remember that while editing the selection, all other options in the Image Enhancement window will not work. Saving the selection area. You can save all the selection areas of the photo for future use using the Save Selection button. Click the Save Selection button. This will open a Save Selection window. The default path of saving the selection will be the Mask folder. Enter a name to save the selection and click the Save button. The selection gets saved in .msk format. Remember that this option will only save the selections and not the changes made to the photo. Loading a saved selection. You can load a saved selection anytime and also edit it. Click on the Load Selection button. A Load Selection dialog opens up. Select the appropriate selection from the list. Notice that the previously saved selections appear on the photo. Remember that this option loads only the selections saved previously and not the changes made to the photo. For editing the loaded selection, click the Selection tool to select the selection area. Click the selection area to be nullified. You can now edit the nodes using the method mentioned under the section editing the selection path using color balancing options. The color balance feature allows you to perform various operations like color balancing and applying various types of tones to a selected part of the photo instantly. Click on the selection area on which you wish to perform the color balancing. The selected area gets converted to dashed. Now drag the CMY and RGB sliders for performing color balancing. Similarly, you can also change the brightness, contrast and gamma by moving the corresponding sliders. Notice that the changes will appear after releasing the mouse. You can reset the changes made to the photo by right-clicking to set the slider to the default value. Click any of the ready tone buttons to apply a tone to the selection instantly. You can also load a tone saved earlier. You can reset all the color changes made by clicking the Reset button. Likewise, you can select any selection area and perform color balancing and get various combinations of color balancing effects. Remember that you can use the color balancing option on multiple selection area using the Control Click option.